all sorts of languages. Diamond language and why this particular method, the dimension method, developed by George Kent, developed the same has developed. So, what is the requirement? See here, I have already told you there are two sides of the infinite. One is countably infinite, like sets of natural numbers, sets of odd numbers, sets of even numbers. You can count them. You can give a number and that is a countable infinite. Here I will show you a function. This is a domain 1, 2, 3. And this is the function. This is the range multiplied with in at first you can see that you have a less number, the number of are not same. At least here the number count is double of this. But actually Proved by diagonalization method, actually the count is same. Count is same. You can count infinitely and by that number. So count is same. Not, not double. This is called countably infinite. You can match it with natural numbers. Let's see another example. Say we have a Ratio n by n, n by n are both natural numbers. We might think that n by n may be more number and huge number than natural, but it is not true. How can I show it? That is a famous diagonalization proof. Any theorem you can prove by induction so that you can practice it by 1 and then plus 2, then you prove it n number and then with n plus 1 number, if it is true, then it is called method of induction. Then another method is exception. So you, you can prove that it is not obeying the theory of the method of exception. Then another method is uh, diagonalization. What is diagonalization method? I have just put 1's here, 2's here, and I divide it by 1 by 1, 2, 3 by 4. So here at least you can convince then I can represent n by n any other function. I can put n by n here. I can hold all ones here and all numbers here n by n. And if you go by diagonalization, you see it can omit this number because 2 by 2 is already, already taken care of. Same is 4 by 2, this is already taken care of. So here if you can count it, then same is here, the number n by n. So this is also a completely infinite and this is a diagonalization method by George Kahn. What I want to say in summary that first thing if you want to map any, any infinite number system, there are two kinds of infinite number system. Natural number like uh, here, like here, and here you have one, two, three, four, five. Number, every machine by this natural. 
Gamma, the K alphabet. Gamma, the K alphabet. 